I have three large boxes here today and they were sent in by a very generous and kind subscriber that had a surplus of fire alarms and they decided to spare those alarms from the trash can and send them into this channel so that they get put to good use. So that means today we're going to get to do a, another large fire alarm unboxing. Huge thank you to the subscriber that sent these in and let's get unboxing. Here we are. Let's go ahead and open it up. Whoa! That's a lot of alarms. Wow. All right, looks like we have a wheel lock ceiling mount, a cedar. I do not have one of these in my collection. Looks like there's a mounting bracket for the alarm. There's another mounting bracket. Here's another ceiling mount, exceder. This is a horn strobe, Gentex SHG. Looks like we have a white wheel lock exceder strobe only. I do not have one of these in my collection. Looks like we have a red wheel lock exceder. I do have one of these in my collection and this was actually the very first fire alarm I ever received. Another red exceder horn strobe, a couple more mounting brackets. Here's another red horn strobe, a couple wheel lock NS covers. Here's a white wheel lock exceder horn strobe. I do not have one of these so that's pretty cool to get one. Another wheel lock exceder horn strobe, red wheel lock NS cover, and another wheel lock exceder horn strobe. I'm not complaining. <laughs> um, here's another horn strobe. This one actually kind of has like a more red tint to its body. I don't know if you can notice it. We're gonna see what's in this box. It is a wheel lock AS. I'm sure everyone that watches my videos frequently knows I do have a ton of these in my collection. Right here is a System Sensor Mass horn strobe. Another Exceder horn strobe. Another one. Another one. Another one. Here is a strobe only. And it looks like we have a wheel lock back box. I don't actually don't know if it's wheel lock, but it is a fire alarm back box. Looks like we have an RSS strobe without a cover. And we have another Exceder horn strobe. Looks like we just have some hardware for one of the alarms and some screws. And that's it for the first box. Box number two. Here we go. And here we are. Ah, it's bubble wrap this time. I guess that's a good thing. <laughs> Looks like we have a bunch of system sensor fire alarms. Let's get to it. That's right, here's the system sensor Spectre Alert Classic. I do have one of these in my collection, but it's always cool to get another. Here's a Spectre Alert Advanced strobe only. I do have one of these. Here's another strobe only. Here's a System Sensor L series. It is missing a mounting bracket. Here's a System Sensor Spectre Alert Advance. Here's another System Sensor Spectre Alert Classic. Here is a System Sensor Ceiling Mount Spectre Alert Classic. I do not have one of these in my collection, so that's cool to get one for the first time. Looks like this one has a fixed 75 candela strobe. Here's another one. Here's some mounting brackets that go with the ceiling mount classics. Here's a Spectre Alert Classic strobe only. It looks like this was the end of line resistor alarm when it was installed in the building. Here's an advanced horn strobe without a mounting bracket. Spectre Alert Classic horn strobe. Another classic horn strobe. Here's a classic strobe. This is an L-series strobe. L-series horn strobe. This one thankfully does have a mounting bracket. P2RL. Here's another horn strobe with a mounting bracket, which is awesome. Another horn strobe, L series, and an L series strobe, L series horn strobe. And it looks like we do have a loose L series mounting bracket. All right, that's it for box number two. Here's the last box. Let's see what we have. Here we go. Dun, da, da, da. Ooh, looks like we have a lot more system sensor. 
here's another system sensor mass, system sensor mass, another mass, mass, you know it, another one, and another one, and one more. Never have I ever had this many system sensor masses, that's eight of them. <laughs> All right, here's another classic horn strobe. I actually do not have a white system sensor classic, so that's really cool. Here's a white L-series horn strobe. Here's a white system sensor spectral alert advanced horn strobe. Looks like we have an L-series mounting bracket. Another mounting bracket for the L-series system sensor spectral alert classic mounting bracket. Looks like it goes with this alarm and white. L-series horn strobe, their Spectral Alert Classic horn strobe, another white horn strobe, another one. Here's a L-series white strobe only, L-series horn strobe. Here's a System Sensor Spectral Alert Classic strobe only. I do not have one of these. That's cool to get one. Another strobe, another L-series horn strobe. Here's an L-series strobe. Couple more mounting brackets. Ooh, it looks like there might be a four wire advance in here somewhere. I'll have to go back through each alarm and see. That'd be cool to get one. I do not have a four wire advance. Maybe it's this one. Nope. Here is an L series horn strobe, another horn strobe, and it looks like the last alarm is another horn strobe. I did go back through and found the alarm that this four wire mounting bracket goes to, and it is this right here. A System Sensor P4RK. And this is actually an uncommon alarm that I do not have in my collection. It's nice because it's four wires, meaning you can power the horn and the strobe on a separate circuit. So that is really cool to get one of these. I went ahead and counted up all the alarms, and in total, today, we unboxed 65 fire alarms. Look at all that. <laughs> wow. When somebody is generous enough to send in this amount of goods out of the kindness of their heart and not ask for a dime in return, I am someone that definitely would like to continue spreading that kindness throughout the community. So I haven't figured out what exactly I'm going to be doing with the extra alarms because I'm going to be keeping some of these alarms in my collection, but I do now have a lot of duplicates that will probably never get used if I keep them. So I definitely want to give back in some way and continue spreading that kindness around. I'm not sure if it's going to be a public giveaway again, but um, yeah, I'll definitely be doing something to give back. So I have... I am worried to say this, <laughs> but I have sent out alarms to people who've messaged me before. Um, I'm not saying I'm going to do that though, because now I know I'm going to get blown up with a lot of private messages for people asking for alarms. As you could imagine, I already do on a regular basis. So I'm not saying to message me and ask for free alarms. But I do want to continue spreading the kindness in some way. Thank you all for watching this video. Huge, huge thank you to that subscriber that sent in all this stuff. I counted 65 alarms. That is amazing. Um, yeah, I'm really grateful and I feel very blessed to receive all this without someone asking for a dime in return. So thank you all for watching this video. Rate, comment, and subscribe and have a great day.